It's a fascinating panorama of the life of one of the great leaders of our times. I'm Meredith Etherington-Smith, and I'm the creative director of the Mrs. Thatcher sale, which is one of our iconic sales. My name is Cynthia Crawford. In 1978, I was invited to go and work for Lady Thatcher. I said, OK, if she loses, I'll go for two years. If she wins, I'll stay for five. 36 years later, I was still there when she died. You could say that I am quite an authority on her wardrobe. Over the years, we chose a lot of stuff together. I would describe my mother as always dressing for the role of Prime Minister. I remember she was going off to some international summit and she said to me, Carol, I must look executive, I'm representing the country. After a busy day in number 10, if she'd come up to the flat, which was home, you can bet the phone would go from the office downstairs saying there's a crisis, therefore she would have had to swap back into the working clothes. So why bother, just wear them all the time. Mrs. Thatcher's style was brilliant colours, sharp outlines, meaning business. I'm sure you will all remember the iconic picture of the Prime Minister in the tank. This is the raincoat which she used, and this is the scarf, which we've treasured all these years. She was in charge and she was in a tank, and I don't think you can get better than that, quite frankly. It's actually brought a tear to my eye. Sorry, gone to pieces. She'd always loved clothes, and it's quite obvious, and all these clothes are in immaculate condition. Was, it, was that in the dining room? Yes, these were in the dining room cabinet, and they were, your father always insisted on having them out for dinner parties. There's an American eagle on a base, and it used to sit in the hall in 73 Chester Square. It was a present from President Reagan. The handbag was a key part of the image. She was a woman of the mid-20th century, and the handbag was a key fashion accessory. And that's something that she carried on. But again, it was an element of professionalism and also an element of function, because a lady can't carry around a briefcase, and there's certain things that she needed to have with her, and that was the most feminine way to have what she needed at hand. Mrs. Thatcher's jewellery was very interesting. It was nice lady jewellery. It wasn't too blingy, it wasn't too new, and certain things were her favourites. The flower petal diamond Georgian brooch. She always wore pearls because she said that they threw light up to one's face. She was very conscious of the image she presented. And this is such a wonderful thing, isn't it? Really key yeah. to the sale, I think, because nothing says Prime Minister yeah. better than her dispatch box. We've seen that every night, your mum and Prime Minister leaning over till one o'clock in the morning. Gosh, when you think of the information that's been delivered yeah. in this case, yeah. it really is a piece of history, isn't it? It was myself who packed it up and put it all away into storage uh, over the years. And we've got almost all of the things that she ever wore at Downing Street. So it's, it's a rather emotional morning for me, actually, because I've lived with all this stuff for 36 years. It's, it's nice to see old friends. We're very proud to be doing this sale. They represent a fascinating insight into our only woman Prime Minister.